guys welcome back to my channel so today we're going to make this very cute lovely uh, lovely Christmas bear so what you're gonna need is you're gonna need two kinds of yarn the red one and the white one so I use this little thin yarn uh, but I use I usually crochet it in a double and also the same case with the red yarn and also I used a crochet hook which is 2.5 millimeters i don't think you can see it on camera but that's what i used and that's what you're gonna need so let's get started okay so we're going to start to the head and we're going to start to the magic ring and six single crochet into the magic ring so we're going to do one two three four five and six okay and then i'm going to pull my yarn okay so now we're going to start the second row and in the second row uh, we're going to start by doing three single crochet in the first stitch so we're going to do three single crochet all in one stitch so I'm going to go into the next stitch and do single crochet one and in the same stitch do another single crochet two and also in the same stitch do the last single crochet so we have three single crochet in the first stitch and then now in the second one uh, in the next one we're going to do single crochet single crochet in the next stitch it's a little bit tight okay so single crochet and also in the next stitch we'll do a single crochet okay and then after that uh, in the next stitch we are going to do also uh, three single crochet all in the same stitch so I'm going to do single crochet one and again in the same stitch another single crochet and the last single crochet in the same stitch and in the remaining two stitches I'll do single crochet each single crochet and single crochet okay so now we have a total of 10 stitches okay so after that, uh, in the next row, uh, which is our third row, uh, we're going to do uh, to start by doing single crochet in the first stitch. So we do single crochet, and then we'll increase uh, two times. So we're going to go into the next stitch and increase. So increase means doing two single crochet in the same stitch. So I'm going to increase the first time and increase the second time. Okay, and then after that, we're going to do three single crochet. So single crochet one and single crochet in the next stitch and single crochet in the third stitch. Okay, and then in the next stitch we are going to increase two times so we're going to increase in the next stitch and also in the next stitch so I'm going to increase the first time and increase the second time in the next stitch Okay, so after that we have two stitches remaining so we'll do single crochet in each stitch so I do single crochet and single crochet okay so after that uh, now in our fourth row we'll start by doing single crochet in the next two stitches so I'll do single crochet and another single crochet Okay, and then now after that, uh, we'll increase two times. So I'm going to increase 
the first time and increase the second time okay and then after that I'll do single crochet in the next five stitches so we'll do single crochet one two three four and five okay and then again we'll increase two times so I'm going to increase the first time and increase the second time okay so now we have three stitches remaining so we'll do single crochet in each stitch so do single crochet until the last stitch okay so now after that uh, so now we have a total of 18 stitches so in our fifth row we are going to do single crochet all the way around for a total of 18 stitches so we do single crochet single crochet okay so continue doing single crochet all the way round okay so after you're done with the fifth row now in our sixth row uh, we're going to start by doing single crochet in the next six stitches okay so we're going to do single crochet one two three four five and six okay and then after that we're going to increase six times so we're going to do first increase and do second increase okay and then third increase and fourth increase Okay, and then do the fifth increase and the last increase okay so six times and then in the remaining six stitches we are going to do single crochet all the way through so we're going to do single crochet until the end Okay, so now we have a total of 24 stitches okay so now in our seventh row we are going to start by doing six single crochets so we're going to do single crochet one okay single crochet two three four five and six okay and then after that uh, in the next one we're going to repeat this pattern six times so we're going to do single crochet increase single crochet increase six times so we're going to do single crochet and then increase so one time repeat again single crochet and increase the second time okay so repeat that until six times okay so after you're done with that now in the remaining six stitches we're going to do single crochet all the way until the end okay so we're going to do single crochet single crochet three Okay, so until the end okay so now we have a total of 30 stitches okay so now in our eighth row we are going to do four single crochet then increase and repeat six times for a total of 36 stitches so we're going to do single crochet one two 
two, three, four, and then increase in the next stitch. And then repeat that again, single crochet, one, two, three, four, and increase. Okay, so you're going to keep repeating that all the way until the end. Okay, so after you're done with that, uh, in our ninth row, we are going to do five single crochet, then increase and repeat all around for a total of 42 stitches. So we're going to do single crochet, one, two, three, four, five, and increase in the next stitch. Okay. And then we're going to repeat that again. So five single crochet. One, two, three, four, five, and increase. Okay, so keep repeating that all the way round. Okay, so after we're done with that, now in our row 10, we're going to do six single crochet, then increase and repeat all the way around for a total of 48 stitches. So we're going to do single crochet, one, two, three, four, five, and increase okay and then we're going to repeat that six single crochets one two three four five six and increase Okay, so keep repeating that all the way round. Okay, so after you're done with that, now for the next seven rows, which is from row 11 until row 17, we're going to do single crochet all the way round in each row for a total of 48 stitches in each row. Okay, so do single crochet for the next seven rows and then I'll see you when you're done with row 17 so that we start the 18th row together. Okay, so after the 17th row, this is how uh, our head looks like. Okay, so now we're going to start with the 19th row. I mean in our 18th row. And in the 18th row, we're going to start decreasing. Okay, so we're going to do a uh, six single crochet, then decrease and repeat all the way around for a total of 42 stitches. So we're going to do single crochet, one, two, three, four, five, six, and then we're going to decrease. So we're going to go into front loop of the next stitch and the back loop of the next stitch and pull through and then pull through all the three loops together. Okay, and then we're going to keep repeating that. So six single crochet. One, two, three, four, five, six, and then decrease. Okay. So you're going to keep repeating that all the way round. Okay, so after we're done with that, now in the 19th row, we're going to do five single crochet, then decrease and repeat all the way around for a total of 36 stitches. So we're going to do single crochet, one, two, three, four, five, six, and 
three, four, five, and then decrease. And then you're going to keep repeating that. So five single crochet. decrease okay so keep repeating that all the way round okay so after that now in our 20th row uh, we're going to do four single crochet then decrease and repeat all the way round for a total of 30 stitches so we're going to do single crochet one two three four and decrease and then you're going to keep repeating that so for a single crochet and decrease okay so you're going to keep repeating that all the way to the end okay so after you're done with that now in our 21st row uh, we're going to do three single crochet then decrease and repeat all the way around for a total of 24 stitches so we're going to do single crochet one two three and then decrease Okay, and then you're going to keep repeating that so three single crochet and then decrease okay so continue repeating that all the way until the end okay so guys, uh, as you can see, I've already started stuffing my doll, so you should start doing that too, uh, because we are almost finished with the head. Okay, so now in our 22nd row, we're going to do uh, two single crochet, then decrease and repeat all the way around for a total of 18 stitches. So we're going to do single crochet, one, and single crochet two and then we're going to decrease and then we're going to keep repeating that so two single crochet and then decrease Okay, so you're going to keep repeating that all the way to the end. Okay, so after that, now in our 23rd row, uh, we're going to do single crochet, then decrease and repeat all the way around for a total of 12 stitches. So we're, go we're going to do single crochet, single crochet, and then decrease. And then we're going to keep repeating that so single crochet and decrease okay so you're going to repeat that all the way to the end and when you're done with this row make sure you stuff the head fully because the next row will be our last row okay so guys as you can see I've already stuffed my head fully so this is how it looks like so this will be the front side so the nose should look upwards like that okay so now we're going to finish up the last row just going to make sure okay okay so now in our last row we are going to decrease six times all the way around for a total of uh, six stitches 
so I'm going to go into the next stitch and decrease and then I'm going to continue decreasing okay so that was our last decrease so after that I'm going to go into the next stitch and then slip stitch like that and then I'm going to cut the yarn okay so after I cut the yarn I have to make sure this gap is completely closed so I'm going to go into the next stitch and pull through and then continue doing that okay and after that I'm just going to go in any of these close stitches and pull my yarn through like that Okay, and then I'm just going to cut it. Okay, so that's how our head is going to look like. So now we're going to start doing the body. For the body, we're going to start with the magic ring first. And then we're going to do six single crochet into the magic ring. So we're going to do one, two, three, four, five, and six. Okay. And then after that, in our second row, uh, we're going to increase all the way around for a total of 12 stitches. So we're going to increase every stitch around so I'm going to go into the first stitch and increase okay and then I'm going to continue into the next stitch and increase okay so you're going to increase every stitch all the way round Okay, so after that, now in our third row, we're going to do single crochet, then increase and repeat all the way for a total of 18 stitches. So we're going to do single crochet, then increase in the next stitch. And repeat that single crochet and increase okay so you're going to keep repeating that all the way to the end okay so after that now in our fourth row we are going to do two single crochet then increase and repeat all the way for a total of 24 stitches okay so we're going to do single crochet one Two, and then increase and then repeat that so two single crochet and increase 
okay so keep repeating that all the way to the end okay so after that now in our fifth row we are going to do three single crochet then increase and repeat all around for a total of 30 stitches so we're going to do single crochet one two three and then increase in the next stitch and then we're going to repeat that so three single crochet and increase okay so continue repeating that all the way to the end okay so after that now in our sixth row we are going to do four single crochet then increase and repeat all the way around for a total of uh, 36 stitches so we're going to do single crochet one two three four and then increase and then we're going to keep repeating that so four single crochet and increase Okay, so repeat that all the way until the end. Okay, so after we're done with that, now for the next four rows, which is from row 7 until row 10, we are going to do single crochet all the way around in each row for a total of 36 stitches in each row. So I'll see you when you're done with the 10th row so that we start the 11th row together. Okay, so after the 10th row, this is how uh, it should look like. So now in our 11th row, we're going to do 4 single crochet, then decrease and repeat all around for a total of 30 stitches. So we're going to do single crochet 1, 2, 3, 4, and then we're going to decrease. And then we're going to keep repeating that so four single crochet one two three four and then decrease okay so you're going to keep repeating that all the way round Okay, so after you're done with that, now we're going to change into the red yarn because you're going to start making the top part of the body. And uh, for the next row, which is the seventh row, we're going to do single crochet all the way round, but in the back loop only. Okay, so we're going to go into the back loop of the next stitch and do single crochet. And then also the back loop of the next stitch do single crochet okay okay so you're going to continue like that all the way to the end for a total of um, 30 stitches 36 okay so you're going to continue like that all the way to the end for a total of 36 stitches okay so after you're done with this row this is how it should look like so for the next three rows you're going to do single crochet all the way around in each row for a total of uh, 36 stitches in each row 